Oh, again, figured, well, I just did a master video, might as well show something similar that's sold in Australia that you should probably also avoid. Um, so this is a jackhammer padlock. Um, I think this is the medium sized version. Um, it's sold at the IGA stores in Australia, uh, independent grocers of Australia. You see one quite commonly in every other suburb. Um, avoid these, these are just absolute rubbish. Um, and they're quite expensive um, for what they are. Uh, I think one of these will set you back like 12 bucks, which is just ridiculous considering what you're getting. Um, anyway, so I might as well start out and just quickly show how useless these things tend to be. Um, I'm going to use a single peak from the, the Bogota set. You could honestly stick whatever you want in here. A paper clip is probably too malleable and will bend too easily. But if you just get any kind of spring steel and put a hook or a bend in the end, you don't even need a tension tool to open these things. It's that easy. Your, your pick itself can become the tension tool while you're like just scrubbing it back and forth. So I'll just kind of like, let, let's demo that quickly. So our pins are here at the bottom. And all I need to do is just put it in the lock, go back and forth while turning it clockwise, and that's it, it's open. Like, this is not worth 12 bucks. This is a waste of, a waste of materials, a waste of money. <laughs> um, yeah. I'll just show you what the key for this little thing looks like. Pretty atrocious. It's the sort of stuff you see commonly in the cheapo range. So it's just a four pinner, N nothing. You, you don't even get much variation on these. I think you might get like five steps if you're lucky. Um, and, and you can tell by just how, I mean, the key might be a giveaway on some of these things, if not the lock itself when you see it in the packaging. But I think another uh, good way of uh, just seeing how crap these are is if you just insert the like it's got this really at first it doesn't want to go in and there's just the tolerances are just so sloppy so junk avoid that's it thanks for watching